Welcome guys. So we've uh, gone on a little bit of a, a trip to Spetses. It's a small island in the Attica of Greece. Um, sometimes it's included in the Saronic Islands, but I think technically it's the Attica of Greece. So we are just, you know, hanging out on the beach. It's quite a nice day. And it's, it's one of the more affluent islands. So generally it's quite nice and quite pretty, as you can see by the town. And um, yeah, just a, a really nice place to be actually. So we're going to spend a few days here and I hope you enjoy, you know, what's to come and I'll try to get as much of what we do and uh, maybe what we eat and stuff like that as well. But I mean, just look at this view. Okay, here it's not very nice with the stone, but just behind that. We've actually, we've rented a scooter. The scooter was about uh, 30 euros for two days or 48 hours. So it's pretty good and we'll go into the other side of the island. It's also quite small, so um, yeah, it's nice to ride around and you know, the petrol is pretty cheap anyway for a scooter, so it should go pretty good. Um, so I'll just make my way back to where we're sitting and um, yeah, and then we'll go over to the next beach. This is like some hidden cave area here. It's not really a cave, but a hidden little rocky beach. There are some sandy beaches as well as uh, rocky beaches, which is quite nice. Um, so yeah, we'll just make our way there. So join me whilst uh, we explore Spetses and uh, yeah, hope you like it, eh? So we've just parked our scooter over here and this is called Paralia Agi. It's quite one of the main beaches here in, um, on the island of Spetses. And during peak season, it would be quite busy with all the, you know, people and speedboats and yachts. And it is um, October at the moment. So it's, you know, much quieter, it's, it's off season. Um, as well as, you know, here you'd have all of the, the price lists for the things to do. So it's quite a nice, nice beach and you can imagine in the summer there must be loads of um, sunbeds all over here. There's a little docking port just at the end there. So it's really quite nice and uh, you can just imagine that these little boats over here are used uh, you know, for traveling out and possibly you can hire them and go out into the ocean, into the sea, should I say, rather. So overall, it's, it's really nice, really nice weather as well in October. It's quite mild during the evenings and during the day, it's, it's quite warm, about 26, 27 degrees. So it's, it's quite a nice time to come actually, because you, you miss all the crowds of people and you get to see everything else. So we've now come to the last, or to the first beach that we saw this morning. Uh, we took a moped ride all the way around. So we went through, I think five or, or six beaches on the way. And it's really nice because there's a ring road all the way around. So it's easy to see the, you know, the whole island within a day and you can just quite accessible if you have a moped. Uh, we were thinking about hiring bicycles, but I think it's just a little bit too far to cycle as well as it's very, very hot. So, you know, if, if you are thinking about taking any bicycles or, or a moped instead, then definitely go for that moped. Um, but as you can see, it's really quiet. Um, it's off peak, like I said before, and uh, just a nice time to be here. And the weather is actually just, just perfect. So um, not too hot and it's, it's not cold at all. So yeah, we're enjoying it. Otherwise, we're going to head into the, to the city. Um, you'll see a little bit of the, the nightlife there, lots of bars and uh, things to eat. And we'll have some dinner there. And uh, that'll be, I think, kind of day one and a half in, in Spitzies. So let's go over to town now. By far the best way to visit the island is uh, to hire a scooter. It's really quite cost effective and also really efficient and uh, you get to do what you like whenever you like without having to wait for a bus or you know hiring a taxi or anything like that. Taking the scooter around you'll come across a long sweeping road that goes right around the island allowing you to see views of mainland Greece such as here just across the water and also just enjoy the fresh air and ride around. 
The centre of Spetses is, is a little town and there's about a handful of streets where you can walk around, uh, view some markets on certain days, such as Wednesday I believe, and also just have a walk during the night. It's, it's really quite pleasant and there's a few boutique shops and a handful of restaurants where you can enjoy a nice meal during the evening. So our first day on the island was spent rather pleasantly. I mean, we just relaxed a little bit. We ended up checking into our hotel, so that took a little bit of time. The rest of the day was spent just walking around the town, having something to eat and getting ready for the other days to come. So I hope you enjoyed this type of video and I do hope you come around for the next episode where we'll be checking out the rest of Spetsies, a little bit of a hidden gem as well as showing you the rest of the island. There's lots to see, quite a bit to do as well, and it's the perfect holiday destination, especially within Europe.